From ponies to thoroughbreds, Tennessee is a big state for horses, more than 140,000 statewide. Horse owners want these beautiful animals to stay healthy, and now there's a new place dedicated to their treatment. I am thrilled to welcome you to the opening of our new equine hospital. UT's College of Veterinary Medicine just opened a $21 million equine and farm animal hospital that includes 85,000 square feet of new and renovated construction. Here people tour the hospital at its recent opening ceremony. Physical therapy will be a key feature here. But probably the crown jewel of it is uh, what we're sitting in right now, which is the Equine Performance and Rehabilitation Center. Uh, there's not another one like it uh, in the United States. The hospital will include stem cell and hyperbaric therapy for healing wounds. This horse was treated for burns using a hyperbaric chamber. There's also a free walking exercise system, cold saltwater spa treatments, and an in-ground underwater treadmill. We're finding now that if we start utilizing some of the same rehabilitation techniques that they do in humans, that we can not only shorten the uh, length of time that horse has to be laid up, we can also uh, improve the quality of the product that we return. Animals benefit from this center and people too. Leaders at the Veterinary College say this provides educational opportunities for future vets who may practice large animal medicine, especially in rural parts of Tennessee where there's a real need. Yeah, so our mission here is to educate students to go out into practice primarily. Some of our students go on to specialization, but most of them go into private practice. And uh, we need to be able to do that on multiple levels. Dr. David Anderson says the new equine center will feature many high-tech surgical options for horses. This particular surgery suite here is a uh, soft tissue surgery, uh, surgery suite, so ligaments and tendons and lacerations and eye surgeries and things like that. We have another surgery suite that's dedicated for orthopedics. More than one million animals have been treated at UT's vet school since it opened in the 70s, including more than 1,400 horses in the last year. If the equine industry is to continue to grow, we'll need advances in medical care for horses. This is Chuck Denny reporting.